Big fight. Anthony Joshua versus Andy Ruiz. Two. Of course, Andy Ruiz shocked the world by defeating Anthony Joshua in the last fight. Um, Not them silly. Yeah. I've been going back and forth on this one. But I had changed my opinion. First, I was taking Andy Ruiz. Then you saw that he lost a lot of weight, and then you turned on him like everybody else. You no, dirty. No, 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 no. No, that's not what made me change my mind. What changed my mind is I went back and watched the fight. And um, I thought, I had thought, I had thoughts anyway about what occurred in that fight. And then I watched interviews with Anthony Joshua. And he let me know that, no, my thoughts was correct. When he got knocked out in that fight, afterwards I said he was worried about Deontay Wilder and Tyson Fury. He had just seen one of them win the fight in fantastic form. So you saw and that. he wanted to do the yeah. same, and he got overzealous in there. Overzealous. 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 Misspoke, but and he got caught. But yeah, the thing is, that, though, we got to remember that he did knock Andy yeah. Ruiz down, and that's the reason why he did it. Because normally, when we talked about that about uh, Dante Wilder, when he knocked somebody down, he just started bum rushing them, yeah. and he don't get caught. And, but it didn't happen yeah, that way yeah. for Joshua. Yeah. He tried to bun rush him, and then he got caught. Mm-hmm. And you like, wait a minute, did yeah. Joshua just get hit? <laughs> yeah, and he and, and he and couldn't, um, I guess, will himself back up. Because and, and that's what he said. He said it in the in the, uh, in the interview I saw. He was like, "Yeah, I was thinking about what had just happened in the other fight, and I wanted to put on the show, and I just got." Two into it, and he caught me with a shot. And he said he had threw the shot before, and it missed. But he then he said he came right back with it, and bam, it caught me. And he said for the rest of that fight, I was on spaghetti legs out there. And so I think this time he'll take his time and um, sit back. Um, Picking spots. Yeah. Pick his spots and land his shot, and I think he'll win. And I'd probably say, um, I'm gonna say this fight gonna end, man, in three or four rounds. I yeah. Think that Anthony Joshua gonna knock Andy Ruiz out in the third or fourth round. I just, I know he he was talking about a trilogy. You think that if he comes out and knock him out real early? No, they gonna go to no, a trilogy. No, could they be like, okay, yeah. that first fight yeah, was it, a it, fluke? It, it, yeah, yeah. If the fight goes, you know, more than if it go nine or ten rounds, then yeah, they'll do a trilogy. But in the third or fourth, they'll say the first fight was a flip, and they'll move on um, to try to make a mega fight with Tyson Fury or um, Deontay Wilder. Wilder. Okay, but um, but that's my thoughts on it, man. I think Anthony Joshua. Gonna get revenge in this fight, and he better. <laughs> he better, but and I think he will. What you got? Yeah, I uh, well, who I think gonna win? That's up in the air. Um, hell, I didn't nobody think that Ruiz was gonna win last time. Um, but I don't know. It, it's Joshua should win. He want to win because. It looked bad that first fight, and like you said, in the doing that round when I had watched it, I think it came on ESPN. I watched it. It wasn't that damn channels. I can't remember. He did look good until he got popped, and that's what I said too. That yo, he got overzealous, went in now, just swinging wild trying to finish him, and got popped. Mm-hmm. I don't know. I guess it was a good hit because he said he was on spaghetti list after that. Yeah. Because that's what I happened, was though when you get punched right behind the ear. Cause I was thinking that yo, like that was the end of the fight after he got dropped. 
Cause he, but no, it went to the seventh round. So that was, I was thinking like, yo, maybe he could have recovered. And I was like, dang, he didn't recover after that because that was like in the fourth round. But I guess. Um, but I don't think he going to come out there and do that same overset of thing. I don't think he going to do it. He going to stick to his game plan. So, yeah, I might give him the edge in this fight. Second fight. He sticks to his guns. He sticks to what he do. Because there was something in that fight that they were like, yo, this ain't the first time that he ain't got knocked down. He got knocked down yeah. in that Klitschko fight, but he yeah, came back and finish that yeah, fight. but he got knocked down before, too. Before that fight? fight? Oh, yeah. so I So, it ain't like, yo. Cause that's one of the things I always had when they ask, can he beat Deontay Wilder? And I always say, not with that chin. <laughs> but no, no, like, the reason I ain't, like, I thought they were like, because listen to Deontay Wilder in his tweet about, after he got down, he saw that he didn't want him, and he he won a real champion. Nah, I disagree. I, I was like, I was thinking, like, yo, that was his first time getting knocked down. But then I had to yeah, think about it. Like, yeah. No, I did remember seeing yeah, him getting knocked down yeah. by Klitschko. Yeah. So. I 100% disagreed when Deontay Wilder said that. And you did uh, trying to take a shot. Yeah, because, you know, Anthony Joshua got hot. But you watch boxing, and you know when you if you and saw a guy hit, get hit with that type of punch behind the ear, yeah, man, hey, those guys be on. Mm-hmm. Like he looked at Dave, like he yeah. was laughing, like wait, yeah. I like get he didn't down? know really what was going on. Yeah, like that get knocked down. Why you count? I remember, um, uh, um, Sergio Martinez. It was like I think it was like his last fight. He got hit with one of those punches, and he just kept falling down. When any guy just hit him, he guy dude hit him. He just kept going down, going down, going down, and it was like, dang. I mean, that's what Joshua was doing. But, so I didn't think that, oh, man, he didn't have no heart. I don't think any person who goes in the ring and have a successful boxing career, all of those guys have heart to get in there. You risking your life getting in there. Mm-hmm. But, yeah, I got Anthony Joshua in this one, though. I agree. 